good morning. It's um, just gone 20 past four and uh, I'm sitting off on a journey to Kingsley in Norfolk from um, Cornwall. So videoing at the moment isn't going to be up to much, but uh, here we go. Um, first stop, exit to services. Uh, we're on charge now. Small issue, car didn't uh, charge last night uh, and didn't precondition. So uh, when I left my house, instead of having nearly 100 miles as I was expecting, I had about 45. So just made it to the charger. Anyway, fingers crossed, uh, extra services and it's, um, it's just gone half past five in the morning. Next service is, um, next up will be Sedgemoor. Well, update, um, charger at um, Sedgemoor Services is um, not working um, and just, just managed to make it to uh, Gordano Services with about 6% um, battery. Uh, it's been reported three or four times by the looks of it over the past three months uh, and it's Ecotricity is saying it's been sorted which it so obviously hasn't so anyway um, second charge uh, it's really cold out there and it's actually minus two at the moment and it's hammering the battery having the heater on and uh, keeping up at motorway speed so Anyway, we're, we're charging at the moment, so fingers crossed, um, we make it to our next charge, which is just outside of Birmingham. Uh, more as it happens. Hello again. Uh, update. Um, more issues with bloody uh, ecotricity chargers. Um, Hotwood services. Charges for about two minutes and then cuts off. <laughs> Uh, fell up and making phone calls to him now. Anyway, um, on charge now at uh, Corley Services. Um, 92%. Should have near enough enough to get me near enough there. Uh, and if I have to, I think I'm going to use uh, the Rex because I, I want to. Uh, want to get there for the last bit anyway um, more as it happens well it's been a, a very long day um, a journey which I could have done a lot quicker had um, three of the ecotricity chargers that I pulled into have been working so the journey which I probably could have done in about five and a half maybe six hours uh, has taken me a considerable amount of time more but I am here I am in Kings Lynn I'm uh, on the charging point that was suggested to me uh, and all is good we are charging we are charging um, anyway um, a return return story tomorrow um, all is good thank you good morning it's um it's now the following day so we're uh, Wednesday and uh, we're just uh, you know, just getting ready to leave. Uh, had a rather nice suite at the Duke's Head Hotel in Kings Lynn, um, and we're just getting to re read. We're getting ready to leave to uh, head off back to Cornwall. So um, see if we can make it less eventful than yesterday, and see if I can actually find ecotricity charges that are working. But reality of it is, I doubt it. Anyway. Um, Come along for the journey. Right, we're in the car and um, nowhere to charge last night um, other than a charging station which is at, um, about five minutes away um, but I didn't want to leave the car there so just gave it a quick top up last night, brought it up to 65% so I'm gonna 
Uh, can't make up my mind whether to whip there now or whether to just crack on to the next, I think I'll crack on to the next charging station which is uh, between Peterborough and um, Rugby. So um, here we go, let's go home. Right, first stop and we are in and charging. Um, this should uh, now give me enough to get to the other side of Coventry. Um, I must admit I am really hammering the battery with having the heater on. So it is a very very cold day. It's, it's shown on the screen as minus two, so cold. Well, back inside the car. Um, I've gone about 45 miles and because I didn't charge fully last night I'm, I'm now having a bit of a top up. I, I have got the heating on full bore, I've got seats on so mileage is, just seems to be diminishing rather quickly. Um, I'm loath to use the rec because I want to try and do it all on battery if I can. Um, but um, I've just done for something about 40, 40, 45, 50 miles. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm sort of pleased considering the fact I didn't have a full charge. Um, I've been using everything else to, to keep warm. Anyway, uh, yeah, so charge up, charge up at um, the services just outside of Peterborough. Uh, and then heading to Corley Services where I shall give it another top up. I think because of just coming back to the i3 I'm still on the top up lots because of the Peugeot Ion which obviously I don't need to do so but I'd rather have enough than not enough. Anyway more as it happens. Well uh, Chorley Services um, and <laughs> yet again problems with Ecotricity. Uh, another phone call to them and apparently the pump is phantom charging. So there was a, another i3 beside me. Um, he started to charge and then he was on charge for about 10 minutes then it cut off. He tried to restart it and it wouldn't go. Uh, I tried to charge and it's taken me the best part of 25 minutes um, for the pump to decide that there isn't actually anyone on it and start charging. Um, and a nice lady at Ecotricity said, well, there's nothing I can do about it. It could take up to 45 minutes, so I'll have to wait. <sighs> shame, really. Crying shame. Hey, but they've got a good football team, apparently. Well, <clears throat> another stop, really, really pleased considering the fact, as I've said, in, so far I've been hammering the heating. Uh, 90 odd miles, um, and we're now at Gloucester Services, and been here for about uh, 20, no, that's a lie, I've been here for 40 minutes, and we are now up to 97%. And this will now get us most of the way home, I'm hoping. Um, so yeah, all is going. Oh, I don't want to tempt fate, but all is all is um, all is good, should we say? All is good. So good evening. Um, just had a really good run um, from just the other side of. Bristol, it's about 25 miles over side of Bristol, uh, down to Exeter, um, and we're now on a charge at Exeter, so I've done 100 and, 100 and something odd miles, um, very pleased that uh, it just seems the warmer the batteries have got, the, uh, the better and more mileage I've got out of the car, yesterday was, was bad, I just seemed to be charging constantly, um, 
with with heater with the heaters on but uh, today hasn't been so bad we've been I've been slowed down more by the snow than anything else anyway final charge at Exeter before uh, before home so uh, all is good